Stephen Curry spent $8 million to avoid this. We're jealous of Stephen for doing this. Stephen Curry is undeniably one of the finest and most well-known NBA players right now. He has a net worth of $160 million, and it's just a matter of time before he becomes a billionaire. With a net worth like this, Curry likes to live a luxurious life, which is understandable. But what piqued our interest was this heavy investment of $8 million. Was it an impulsive decision, or was Curry trying to avoid something? Keep watching this video to find out. How Chef Curry Earned His Fortune Steph Curry's pay as a point guard for the Golden State Warriors has been highly lucrative, not to mention the millions he earns from brand endorsements and other businesses, such as his filmmaking firm and shares in companies like FTX. Steph agreed to a $215 million contract deal with the Dubs in 2021. This man was the first player in NBA history to sign an agreement for more than $200 million. This makes Curry the NBA's highest paid player. The six-footer is set to earn $45 to $47 million in the 2021-22 season and $48 million in the 2022-23 season. Steph's yearly salary for the 2023-24 season will be $51.9 million. In addition, he'll earn $55.7 million and $59.6 million in the next two seasons. It appears that this decade's luck charms are all in favor of Curry. According to Forbes, the baby-faced assassin is the world's fifth highest paid athlete this year, earning a total of $92.8 million, including $47 million from brand endorsements for companies like Google, Rakuten, 2K Sports, Panini, and Callaway Golf, among many others. Since 2013, Curry served as the ambassador of Under Armour's footwear brand. He earns $20 million every year from Under Armour. And a little birdie told us that he's close to signing a $1 billion deal. Film producing career. Curry joined forces with Garen Smith and Eric Payton in 2018 to launch his career as a film producer. Together with his business partners, he established Unanimous Media, a production company. Unanimous Media is renowned for producing motion pictures with a focus on family, faith, and sports. The production business quickly began to produce profitable movies after entering a lucrative partnership with Sony Pictures. It's also known that Unanimous Media created the golf-themed minigame Holy Moly. Curry took part in the show and leveraged his fame to make it more well-known. The Curry-focused documentary, Stefan vs. the Game, was also produced by Curry's production business. He invested $14 million in the making of the movie Breakthrough, which brought in almost $50 million at the box office. The financial success of Stephen Curry has reportedly been attributed to his positive attitude toward money. He believes in minding his own business rather than comparing his achievement to that of his peers. However, when it comes to living a lavish life, the golden boy is no exception and enjoys spending extravagantly on expensive stuff. So, let's get started with his sickest car collection. Curry's most costly possessions is his car collection. It's been compared to Jay Leno's most expensive collection. The MSRP of the Tesla Model X is $93,184. We're sure he drives to his games in Tesla's autopilot mode so that he can relax before the games. As a brand ambassador for the Infiniti car automobile, Curry had the unique opportunity to own the Infiniti QX0 concept. He's rumored to have helped build the three-wheeler and then used it, particularly to trick his best friend forever, Kosizi, who was astonished and called the car the worst he'd ever seen. The concept car, on the other hand, is built with six air turbines that assist in recycling air and fueling the organic engine. The Infiniti QX Inspiration concept is a medium-sized SUV and the brand's initial effort to create its first fully electric vehicle. The QX Inspiration, often known as the Baby FX, was initially shown at the Detroit Auto Show. The car is currently priceless because it's the only one, and Steph Curry is indeed the lucky owner, which is quite awesome. Stefan has a car collection that would make anybody envious. He doesn't limit himself to one sort of vehicle. He has cars for just about every kind of journey. The Porsche Panamera Turbo S is his regular sports car that satisfies his desire for speed. With 550 horsepower under the hood, this road racer can reach speeds of up to 190 miles an hour. Stefan paid a whopping $150,000 for this gem. His Porsche 911 GT3 is a high-performance variant of the Porsche 911 sports vehicle designed particularly for racing. So unlike his other Porsche, this one isn't for driving the kids to school. 
This beast costs roughly $189,000. It's slightly more expensive than the Porsche with two fewer doors. Stefan's Range Rover Sport LWB is the most expensive car in his collection so far. It's an all-around family car with dramatic style and extra features. It's a $210,000 car right out of the box, but like all of his things, Stefan prefers to customize them, choosing some custom 22-inch wheels for the classic white car. We don't mind if we get to experience Curry's life for only one day, please? Let's not forget about his off-roader, the Mercedes G55, which is priced just in the center at $123,600. Rack and pinion steering, as well as 0 to 62 miles per hour in 4.5 seconds, is the fastest for this sort of car ever. And the supporting V8 engine delivers a respectable peak speed of 155 miles per hour. Elegant timepieces collection. Steph Curry's impeccable style is hardly ever complete without a beautiful wristwatch. His shooting ability has demonstrated his style as a point guard, but his elegant style ensures that the same character is maintained off the court. His watches range from inexpensive to made-to-order timepieces. Before we get into the specifics of his wristwatches, we'd want to compliment Curry. Oh my god, Steph, you have great taste! Aww. Steph Curry wore the newest addition to his watch collection while rooting for his team, despite recovering from an MCL injury. He donned a brand spanking new rose gold Santos de Cartier skeleton, originally exhibited at the SIHH in 2018, during a November game against the Dallas Mavericks. The model is a completely new take on the brand's classic Santos. It's part of a new series of in-house movements that are hand-wound. Each movement was carefully crafted by Cartier to produce the bridge's signature Roman numeral designs. When Curry isn't a Cartier man, he's a Rolex man. Deep Sea Diver and Evero's day-date president models frequently grace his wrist. The inclusion of a model like the Santos de Cartier skeleton in his collection demonstrates a new degree of elegance. It'll be fascinating to see which brand he buys next if the Warriors win another season. Yikes, we can barely wait! Curry's property collection. Stephen Curry's large net worth allows him to enjoy a luxurious lifestyle. He paid $31 million for his current home in Atherton, California in June 2019. It was the largest house acquisition in the Bay Area that year. The three-story home is on 1.2 acres of land and includes, among many other things, a swimming pool with a poolside cabana, a built-in barbecue, a fire pit, a guest house, and a basketball court. Curry has a net worth of $160 million, which he can use to buy expensive cars, real estate, and a sizable watch collection. But who would have thought that he would randomly invest millions of dollars for such a strange reason? Why did he spend $8 million on a condo? When the Warriors shifted to the Chase Center in 2019, Steph found it difficult to get there from his house in Atherton. He was regularly 20 to 25 minutes late. When people like you and me are running late, we just start our day 30 minutes earlier than usual. But we're talking about Steph and Curry here, and Curry needed to hurry. So that's why he simply chose to move near Chase Center to avoid daily traffic. How expensively cool is that? Steph invested $8 million to buy the penthouse on the 30th level of the Four Seasons residence. However, he now has a place to relax before and after games, and Chase Center is only a five-minute drive away. The fact that International Smoke, the restaurant owned by his wife, Aisha Curry, is only a block away is a bonus. And we believe that when you earn as much money as Steph does, you can get rid of everything that can cause you to lose focus on your work. Somebody has rightly said that when money talks, everything else walks. Even if it's an $8 million condominium, it'll walk towards you to necessitate you. What are your thoughts on Curry's purchase? Do you think he was justified in spending $8 million? Let us know your thoughts in the comment section below and don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel. Psst, if you're still here, let us know what you want to see in our next video.